Demo Alley, and this is Creativation NAMTA 2022, and we are here with Hero Arts and with Maria showing off the brand new Hero Wax and Pearls. So let's see all the funness that is going on with this, and let me switch the camera around. There we go. Okay. And all right. take it away. <laughs> all right, so this year we've got a new product called Hero Wax, and we've got three different colors. So we've got a beautiful gold, a black, which kind of looks like a gunmetal gray, but I mean, it's black, but it has that gunmetal hue to it. And then a white, which is actually this just insanely gorgeous pearlescent. I don't know if you can, is the camera picking that yeah, up? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's beautiful. So um, this is really fun because you can burnish it. So here I just burnished over the top of some of our hero paste. And I just rubbed it over the top of it with my finger to, to gild it. And it just gives us a gorgeous golden finish. Um, but you can also use it with a stencil. So that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to go ahead and take this stencil and I'm going to use the black wax. And I'm going to use it actually with this brand new palette knife from Hero Arts. I love this because it is metal. Down there we go. Yeah. There we go. See it. There we go. Okay. So metal, brand new metal palette knife with a wooden handle. I love it. And then the shape is perfect because for smaller tins of product like this, it's just, it's the perfect size and shape so that you can dig deep into a smaller product container and get what you need. So I'm just going to apply this over my colorful background. And I'm going to apply it just like I would apply a paste. And of course, I, I showed you the other project where I burnished with the gold. Um, so you could burnish with the black or with the pearlescent as well. This time we're just going to do it a little bit differently. So that's what it looks like if you just do the paste. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to heat it and it's going to blow up a little bit like a hot air balloon. Oh, fine. It's going to take a second since I just sprayed my paper and my paper's a little wet. Can it air dry if you let it sit? It can, yeah, it can air dry if you let it sit. I've just been kind of having fun playing with the different techniques. Um, and actually, if it's going to take too long for your video, I can just show you a different one. Sure, just that's what this one is, one. right? Yeah. So this is a different one that I did. It's the exact same thing. and I, It's like a cooking show. We're ready. Yeah, I know. We're ready. <laughs> well, it's done. Um, so I heated it, and you can see, I hope, that it's got a, it's raised. It's like it's super mm. raised, so it blew up like a little hot air balloon. Um, and then over the top of it, I used this gold hero wax. I'm just going to move this out of my way since this is wet. I'm going to show you this. It's just such a luscious gold color. That's pretty. Yeah, so I just like to dip my finger in and just get a little bit on there. I'm going to dab it to make sure I'm not going deep in the crevices. And then I just burnish lightly over the top. And it just gives you a beautiful gold gilded finish. How gorgeous. Yeah, really beautiful. So then the other product that we have new today are the new Hero Pearls. And we have four colors and they're all basically metallic. There's a white, but it has like a metallic hue to it. Let me just get the lid on here so these don't dry out. Um, do they, should I ask that, so like how long do these, do they get kind of, is there a lifetime to them, I guess that's the way you, to ask. You, do you know what? I don't know the answer to that question. Okay. All I know it is a wax-based product that is permanent on most surfaces after it dries. Oh, nice. And then I've been experimenting with it, and so you saw me heat it, but they have all a little bit of a different behavior when you heat them. So this is the gold wax. I applied it thick. Um, and then when I heat it, you can see that it got all bubbly and crusty. Mm. Um, here where it was applied more thinly, you just got some tiny little fizzle bubbles, you know. So the black didn't respond the same way. It wasn't as bubbly. It, it just like the whole thing wanted to puff up and raise. So it's interesting how the same product in two different colors will react just a little bit differently. But it's fun to know before you try to use it. Yeah. Um, then let's, okay, so we got these. <laughs> so we've got pewter. Hang on, I'm going to try and face them all forwards. There we go. So we've got pewter, white, silver, and gold. And then I'm just going to give you guys a little score to all of these because they're just beautiful to see. Yeah. Look at this. And actually, here they are. Can you see that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And are they puffy so, or are they flat? Can so this I smeared. I'm going to, I wouldn't paint with them. Um, well, I shouldn't say that. I haven't tried it yet because this is the first I'm seeing of them. I actually didn't get to work with these at all before Creativation. Um, we only got enough just to be able to show them at the show. So right. this, I mean, they're oh, nice. just beautiful. Really easy to do drops with. And look, 
No Hershey's Kisses. For those of you who are drop challenged, yes. zero Hershey's Kisses on nice. those. I mean, with zero effort, too. That was not hard to do at all. So that was the gold. This is the white. And you can see how it's almost like a metallic white. You know, it's mm -hmm. more than a pearlescent. It's got a metallicness to it. This is the pewter. Yeah. Got a little bubble. So again, super easy to make those dots with. I love that too. It's almost like a little bit of a gun metal. Just yes. kind of matches that wax. And then this is the silver. When I was doing the sample boards, I kept getting bubbles with this one. I think it was because it was a brand new. So you can just see how beautiful those are. I'm sorry it's on a scratch paper. Oh, no, no, you're fine. Oops, wrong that's wrong what I got. Again. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, and then um, something that I did with it earlier was I had just dragged the piece of paper through it because I just wanted to see what it what it looked like. Um, this is all a mess, but I mean, can you see it? Oh, yeah, beautiful. It's beautiful, and so I had actually, this is what I had dragged through it, and it ended up with those cool drips. Those so are, those are fun. I'm yeah. probably at some point I'm going to try using these with a stencil, too, just to kind of see how those oh, look, yeah. you know, how they look. But Do you I feel mean, like it's thick or thin? I feel like it's creamy. Oh, okay. It's okay. weird. It's sort of a different texture than I'm used to, you know, like a typical drop being. Right, right, right. Um, they feel softer and creamier, and they just come out almost like butter. That's like butter is a good description for all of these new products, actually, because they they look like they're thick and and like just luscious, but they really are smooth and creamy. Is that a couple that are smeared on top here? Exactly. Yeah. So I did the our regular hero paste, and then that's the gold of here on the top, and then a customer wanted to come and try it out. So this is the gold, and then that's the black. Very cool. Yeah. Well, awesome. Yeah. Well, yeah. thank you so much. Yeah. I truly appreciate it. Uh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> Do you know when any of these are going to be released or available? Yeah, they're available for retailers to order right now, and then these will be launching in our, what month is this? Summer April. Summer catalog. Summer, okay. Summer. summer. Catalog, so be ready for it this summer. summer. So there you go. You got the new skinny on some brand new products that are going to be ready and released this summer that you can get from Hero Arts. Thank you so much for the Thank awesome you. demo, and make sure to check out Hero Arts. Don't forget to like and subscribe. More videos to come today. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Bye, everybody. Thanks, Aaron. Yeah. It's fun, right?